Hey, what's going on, everybody? You can call me Sniffy, and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Beta 1.7.3. Uh, another weekly episode of this. What's the goal of this episode? Well, first of all, get away from that annoying nether portal. The point of this episode is I want to work on the railways a bit more. And so it's probably not going to be the most riveting, exciting thing, but that's fine because I do want to do it. So, <laughs> where's that sheep? Where is it? Oh god, it's over there. Okay, I'm gonna get some stone because we need stone in order to actually do that stuff. So down we go into the quarry. When's the last time I shown this? I don't know. It's actually it's been a while since I've been down here anyway. I mean it's been a while since I got into this world again, right? So look at this thing though. Isn't this a classic like a thing you do in old Minecraft? No one does this shit anymore. I actually want to though in my current playthrough. Anyway, I'm gonna cut this boring part out. With a super snippy smash! Ah! Oh, I only broke two layers, but look at that! Redstone! We're at redstone level already! Isn't that awesome? There could be diamonds here now. Any any moment now, we might even just literally right now find some diamonds. That was iron. I knew that was gonna be iron. It's it's the four by it's the two by two pattern. Look, it's gonna go down two as well. I know the ore generation patterns yeah oh shit bedrock wait what oh we've already been at that level oh god no i only went down four blocks i thought there was whoa look at the moon there it is look how nicely that frame oh that's good it just frames it perfectly in there wow okay well i thought that we were a ways away from it still but no we were, we were literally we're at bedrock level. Is there even room for another torch? Yeah, just barely. Maybe. Actually, there might not be. Isn't there bedrock on there? No, there is actually a perfect amount of room. Wow. I don't know how that happened. Anyway, I'm getting this stone so that we can work on the railway, right? Because we need to do that. There's also another thing I need to make that I, 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 left, I left an episode on a cliffhanger. And I forgot to actually do it. Now my pickaxe is broken, but that's fine. We don't need more than stone for this, you know? You know, we definitely don't need more than that for this. I gotta say, an aspect of beta that I still miss is how disposable tools are, you know? They really don't mean that much. I mean, obviously iron can mine diamond and stuff, and diamond can mine obsidian, but like, oh, if you if you have enough of that stuff, generally, you don't really need them anymore. I mean, in a way, it's like, uh, it makes them, you know, more useless, but... I like that you have a reason to make more than just one tool, you know? Like, have I made more than one pickaxe in my current playthrough in Modern Minecraft? No. I I did, what, a Silk Touch and an all pick? And a Fortune pick, and that's it? That's not enough. That's not enough. I want a chest full of backups, you know, in case something ever goes wrong, but I'm too good to die. Unless I fall into the void in the end. But, you know. So I won't be... Needing backups. I mean, who needs back backup tools in modern Minecraft? Honestly, okay, genuinely, when was the last time you had to make backup tools in Minecraft? It it it, it had to have been. Oops, it had to have been, it had to have been a while, right? Am I crazy? Don't answer that. Okay. So three blocks. Oh yeah, no, I won't be able to put more torches. Uh oh. Uh oh, spaghettios. I do uh, three, right? So one, two, three, and then it would be here. This has bedrock right here, and that's literally where I'd be putting a torch. So you know what? We'll just put them on the floor instead. That's not a bad compromise. Unless they're uh, over here, and... You know. You're over here, and there's no stone to put a freaking thing on. Okay. Well, let's just make some actual clean stone anyway. We're gonna need it anyway for our build, so I have no reason to just I have no I have no reason to not just do that. What I'm gonna do here I wanna put glass on this layer and then keep going down like as far as it'll go. I mean it'll it'll be This is as far as it goes. There you go. Never mind. That that is. You know what I wanna find though? I wanna find the void. I wanna see if I can get access to the void here. Or if that's patched in this version, actually. I don't know. I know in Alpha and older Minecraft, you can actually go to the void. You can... Sometimes there'll be a gap in the bedrock. And I like that. Because it's... It's 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 a, it's a thing that you... 
I don't know, if, I feel like it promoted exploration of it back then. I mean, hell, imagine how few people would have even learned about the Void in Minecraft if that wasn't a thing, right? Like, if you only learned about it via a wiki or debugging like that, that would, that would have made a lot less people even know it exists. Like, how many people did, you know, just, just was like, oh, wow, what is this stuff? Oh, I can't break it. Oh, man, that's weird. Uh, I wonder uh, if I can, like, get around it. And then, you know, you'll you'll dig around, and, and then you'll go over around here, and then you'll see there, and then you can see there. I can't go any further. Yeah, no, I don't I think there is a solid bedrock floor in this. That's a shame, but point is, it would lead people to see it, and then e experiment with it. Like, they, I remember seeing a video of someone, like, literally just like, what is this, you know? Oh, what, what is this void in Minecraft? And, you know, like, them putting, like, a bucket of water and seeing the water just disappear as it reaches it. And, or, like, throwing items down there and just having them vanish. I mean, it's a, it's a little thing, right? But it, it's just, like, a tiny little thing that you'd have to discover through gameplay as opposed to just... Well, I mean, how else would we have learned about it? Just seeing something like that for ourselves. You know, seeing, like, a video of that or, or just reading about it on, like, the wiki or whatever. It's always nice just letting the player get their their hands on it and finding out for themselves, you know? At least that's the way I look at it. And that's why I like the void in this in these old versions. So I that's why I like Bedrock actually. Bedrock is it, it it's an extension of the player's uh, will to get around the game's limits in a extremely obvious way because it's literally an unbreakable block yet you can you can still slip by the cracks you can still slip by the cracks and find little bits that you might be able to you know get out of uh, unfortunately i'm stuck <laughs> there's a solution right there yeah no i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna keep going here i'm gonna keep going until there's no stone left that's what I wanted. I wanted this to have a bedrock floor, and I'm gonna get it, damn it, if it's the last thing I do. Oops, well, I don't want that to be like that. Well, maybe I do. No, I don't. Screw that. I was gonna cut all of this out, but we're already at the bedrock, and I, I, wanna, I wanna get intimate with the bedrock. That I wanna, I wanna experience the bedrock. You know? I think we have, though. I think that is actually just about all the stone that was in this area. And I think we are now officially at the bedrock limit. If the if this version does let me see under the bedrock, I don't think we can here. I don't think it does though. I'm pretty sure there's a solid block layer on the bottom. Again, in alpha there's like occasional gaps in it. And that's what my goal was in the well, that wasn't my goal, but it, it was the goal I ended up going with in, in the Alpha uh, Christmas video. Anyway. Uh, let's actually just line the edge with normal stone so that there's some level of consistency. Oops, that- why didn't it let me put that? Okay, that was weird. Boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. That's- How dare you! Okay. Yeah, that's fine. That's not fine. And now it's fine. And now it's not fine. Now it's fine. There we go. There we go. All right, let's get back up and let's start working on the railway. It's a bit of a shame that we didn't find any diamonds down there. However, that is a very... You need to shut up, Portal. Seriously. That is a very uh, easy access point to that level. Oh, what the hell? Terry, hey, how you doing, man? What is this? Why are there feathers here? Did you kill a zombie? Terry, did you kill a zombie, Terry? That's not Terry, actually. He would have looked at me if it was Terry. No, this is just some random chicken. Okay, well, maybe Terry was here. Maybe Terry saved those chickens from the zombie. I mean, we know the baby zombies, they try to ride the chickens, so... Terry was there to save the day. I think that's what happened. I mean, I don't know who to save the day, actually. Honestly, it could have been any, anyone, but... If anyone's gonna just leave the scene of the crime without any trace of their existence besides... Well, I guess the feathers, it probably would be Terry. Okay. So, uh, actually, to work on the railway, what we need to do is... 
let's let's just let's get started on a ground base design so you know what I'm trying to actually do. Uh, I do need a glass. So unfortunately, I need to go get some sand. And that's a classic of the beta playthrough is me digging sand. That's like a classic staple. So the question is, do I use cobble or do I use clean stone for this design? Because my goal is to do this. Actually, uh, I feel like it's a waste to not put glass here, because then you could see way more. Yeah, I feel like that's actually better. To just have glass here. I mean, when you're if you're if you're if you're going to be walking the path. Yeah, no, I think that's fine. Wait, didn't I want to put fences? I think I wanted to put fences, like so they'd be like kind of like railings. No, I don't know, actually. Oh, man, now I'm conflicted. Well, that's why we're testing. Here, let's let's test. Wait, no, fences are absolute nightmare to work with. You know what? Just for that alone, I'm not doing it. <laughs> Shut up here, O'Brien. Enough of your interjection. I don't need your interjections, okay? I remembered that word existed and immediately used it twice in the exact same way in a row. Okay. Let's get some glass. Let's get some stone. Uh, actually, I think I do want to put glowstone on, on in this structure. However, I that's going to require that's going to require a lot more preparation that I don't want to make right now. So I'm going to wait for all this stone to smelt. It's not nearly enough, by the way. I mean, the railway's massive, to be honest. But I, we're definitely not finishing it this episode. However, I want to get the uh, ground basis set up. Actually, we can just start that now with what we have. I mean, yeah, I think a too tall glass is a good idea, and I do want a glass on the ceiling. It's honestly going to be more glass than anything else. If, I, if I'm going to be honest, it's probably just going to be, like, smooth stone like this. I don't want cobble. I changed my mind. I, I, I didn't change my mind. I was testing it, and my conclusion is that I don't want cobble. I want this, and I want this. As simple as that. And then I won't need any torches because I'll be using glowstone. But I'm going to keep them there temporarily because that's when I'm going to distribute the glowstone. So it's going to be like... I think I'll put it up here, actually. The glowstone will be up here. That's not a bad way to go about it, is it? I think that will be... Fine? Huh. Would it be better... Well, I already put a bunch of glass, so that, that'd be a waste because there's no silk touch. I can't really get it back, but would it be better to put the material out instead of... Oh, shit. Ow. Ow. Ah! I thought I was holding shift. It's because it, it barely moves your screen in this version, so you can hardly even tell if you're pressing it. I mean, I thought I was putting pressure on the key. I guess not. <laughs> Oops. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, no, I think... Huh. I don't know. I mean, you have to remember that torch is not going to be there in the final product. I mean, I think it'll be okay. I, I feel like I should actually put the glass and the wall out one more so that it, there's a little more depth to the structure. Like, look here, let's just try it on this side. It's a waste of materials, I know, but I, I want to do it. I have to know. I have to know. I'm not going to know if I don't test it. Uh, I think that's better. Okay, the question, though, is... How does it look from the outside? I mean, I don't know. I don't think... It, it's Okay, it's better because it's more room... But it's not better because this was in always intended to be a wall anyway. This is always intended to be something you wouldn't walk on. You're like, you're not meant to walk on the stone. You're meant to walk on the gravel. That's what I got it for. So, that being the way it is, I don't, I don't think that that's better. I mean, it might look a little better, but I, I don't think it's, I don't think it's, I don't think it serves the purpose that I that I, that I set out to, to give it, so we're gonna get rid of it. I know it's a waste. Oh god, look at every single one of these as they break in excruciating detail. That's the sound of pain is what that is. Honestly, even this. 
I look at this. Look, something about mining and with F1 on. It's like it's like playing classic or something. Okay. I think what I might do. I might. I might put slabs on top of all the stone and then glass along the ceiling and then that'll just that'll wrap around and that'll uh, end up being complete. Oh, you know what? The redstone torches. That's that's actually hmm. That's a bit of an issue. Cuz if I'm putting glass here, then there won't be room for that. What if Now hear me out here. What if, oops, I replace, actually, I don't need to do that. I can literally just put glass on the ceiling. Is there a problem with a three, too high ceiling in this version? Well, it, I don't like too high ceilings in general, but I don't actually think it'll be a big deal here. Uh, hmm. Hmm. No, I, I mean, it's fine though. It does what it needs to do. It's not exactly a problem. I mean, I'm gonna be riding the damn rail cart anyway. I think I'm gonna just screw it, do it. I just broke that for no reason, but yeah, I know, I'm just gonna do it. I know it's not the most eloquent, elegant solution ever, but that is what I wanted from the start. That is what I wanted this to look like. Well, not look like, I guess, but God damn it. It is what I wanted in terms of design. Yeah, you know, let's just test it on the cart. I mean, it's fine when you're in the cart because when you're in the cart, you're a little shorter. So yeah, it's fine. I mean, it's how often am I really gonna walk this path anyway? The idea is that I ride the cart. I think that's fine. Well then, let's use what we have. The glowstone will have to replace the torches. Uh, and I'll have to fill in the glass that they're currently taking up. However... When, when it comes to the... When it comes to the, the redstone torches, that's kind of another issue. In of itself. Is that three tall? That's three tall. I'm gonna need to... I'm gonna need to replace the torches, the, the redstone ones, with something else. Okay, we have a problem here. Entering this is pretty claustrophobic. What I need to do, actually, is break this. God, I hate doing that. I'm still doing it anyway. We need to get did, you need to get detector rails, detector rails, or uh, the pressure ones. I forget how you make them though. I actually have no idea how to make them. I don't even know if they're a thing in this version, to be honest with you. So we're actually in for quite the uh, mystery. We're in for quite the mystery, and I genuinely have no idea where to begin on solving it. I have absolutely nothing to go off of. How does three times forty end up with this amount? Oh, yeah, I don't know. Okay. Um, let's figure it out then. I'm assuming I need redstone and iron. I don't think I need gold. I don't know if I need a pressure plate. Is it just like a rail, but with pressure plate instead of a stick? Or do you add one on? Huh. No, you don't put two redstone there. Oh boy. I feel like I'm making Minecraft crafting recipes ideas now. Uh, not just gonna be more iron. That's bizarre. What would that make? That's a like a shield or something. Saddle. No. <laughs> okay, here. Let's let's do a pressure plate. It doesn't seem right. It doesn't seem right. I want it to be right, but it just doesn't seem right. Oh shit, that is right. Wow, what a recipe. That's a weird recipe, dude. That is a serious... Okay, honestly, just look at that. Doesn't that look cursed? That looks cursed. That looks really goddamn cursed. I hate that. This is the ugliest recipe in the game. I love it. 
I want more ugly recipes. That's amazing. Okay, well, now we have a good reason to make a bunch of pressure plates. I don't know if this is uh, too much or whatever, but we're just going to do it. Uh, except for the fact that I don't have nearly enough iron. I can't believe that's the recipe, dude. That actually looks like something that you'd see in a Minecraft crafting recipe. It's like for a... Iron Man armor or something. I don't know. It's like it's like the, the freaking core in the middle. You use redstone and a pressure plate. And it's like... It's pressure activated. And it'll... It'll give you strength too when you activate the when you press the button. And it's like Iron Man. Did you watch that movie? The single movie? There's only ever been one. There's definitely not been five thousand. Okay. Boom. Boom. That's as many as I can make. Is it enough? It actually might not be. Was that expensive on my iron side? Absolutely. Is it a problem? You betcha, because I don't have much to begin with. Now I have even less, but that's fine. Okay, let's let's go sleep. Make it daytime. After I pass by my wonderful classroom. Wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. Why is there sheep out there? Why are there sheep everywhere? There must be an ambush, because they always accompany enemies. Because they're definitely the good guys. No, I don't see anything. I can sleep without monsters being nearby. <laughs> I'm, whoa, I'm up. Yeah, no, there's no monsters. I probably should have got my sword out. Uh, I was just not paying any attention, though. Oh, well. Oh, actually, I need to get some more bread. I don't have bread. But I can get bread. Luckily, I have enough wheat to last me several lifetimes. I mean, I don't even know what classifies as a lifetime in Minecraft, because, you know, you don't age. I guess it'd be your health bar, but your health bar is, you know, perpetually being added to and removed from. So, yeah, I don't know. That's a bit of a strange, a bit of a strange way to categorize things. There's a, sh there's a creeper over there. What did I tell you? What did I tell you about the sheep and having cre enemies near them? Okay. So, I don't actually know 100% how detector rails work, so we're gonna find that out here. I believe you have one on- okay, let's see what happens when we have one on just one side. I'm sure that won't work. Like, let's see, push the cart. Yeah, no, it just gets stopped. So, yeah, I think it needs to be on this side. Or on both sides, I should say. But now that it's like that, it will go across full speed. Good. Okay, that's what I want. So it takes up less room, because you don't have to have redstone torches, however, it's a lot more expensive. And I can see why everyone in their right mind would just use redstone torches. However, I've never actually gone out of my way to use these before. You can tell, because I didn't even know how to goddamn craft them, so... With that in mind, I'm actually happy to have a use for these now, finally, after all this time. It's kind of nice. It's kind of sad not seeing these be lit up all the time because they look nice when they're lit up, but on the plus side, I can get rid of the awkward torches like that. So, you know, it's not so bad. Why the hell is there a redstone torch here? Why was there a redstone torch there? Why was that there? I have no idea why that was there. That that actually makes no sense at all. I genuinely could not tell you in a million years why that was there. Unless it was a part of a previous design that I just abandoned. Oh, I think that is what it actually was. Wow, go figure. Oh, God! I knew you were here, and you still scared me. Oh my god, do not blow this up. This is heavily important construction work. Okay, you cannot blow this up. It will make me upset, and you don't want to see Snippy when he's upset. Like how this stone is making me upset. Okay. I just, I just love placing blocks in Minecraft. Don't you guys love placing blocks in Minecraft? It's my favorite thing. How am I going to make this entrance less claustrophobic? This is supposed to be like a stopper. Complete with chest, stopper, and a workbench for some reason. <laughs> I don't even know why that's there. Uh, I guess it can just be like that. That's, that's not a bad thing, right? If anything, what I want to do, actually, is extend the platform a little bit. And then we can have, like, fences there. 
I feel like that might be a good idea. Yeah. I need fences, though. I, mean, I have some in the chest. Let's just go get those, because I don't want to sit there and make them. I also need to get more of the stone that's down here anyway. Our goal is to just use what we have today, and then... I don't even know when I'll finish this, I'll be honest. I don't know. I mean, I guess there's no harm in just spending next episode finishing it some more as well. There's no harm in that. That's the way it goes, you know? That's the way it is, as the Red Dead 2 song goes. How many times am I going to say that joke? I don't even it, I don't even know how much you can call it a joke anymore, I'll be honest. Well, it is a joke, but, you know, <laughs> it's... A, never mind. I got fences. That's what I wanted. That's what I got. Loving. That's what I got. Do you remember that? Alright, see, I know the lyrics now. Kind of. Maybe. I think that's correct. Okay. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Boom. And then boom, 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 boom. And this is the entrance. So like boom, 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 boom. And I guess these torches should probably be just gotten rid of or put on top of the fences. Excellent. Absolutely wonderful. And with that, I think this system is still okay for activating the rails. This is usually what I do. Oops. Uh, that usually works. Uh-oh. Come back. No, stop. Oh, oh wait, no, that works if I'm if I'm writing it. Wait, does it? Hold on, now I need to test that again. There we go. Oh yeah, no, that still works. Oh wait, that one actually doesn't. This one needs a redstone torch. Because I don't have a detector to land on. Ooh, that is a problem. I mean... I guess that is fine. It doesn't really get in the way of the walkway. It'll be the only obstruction, literally, in the whole thing. I mean, this is already a scuff to design to begin with. Actually, wait a minute. I need to build supports for the whole thing. That's another part of this that I haven't even begun on. Uh, I want to build supports along the way. I could just put it underneath this block. Wait, no, because it's gravel. Wait, no, I could do that. Wait, I could do that right now. I don't need to do any support building. Yeah, let's just do that then. Wait, what is this? What? Oh. All right. I saw it's powered on in my inventory. <laughs> I thought it was like the powered on variant. Uh. Okay. Just break that. Ooh. Put there. I don't want it there, but it's fine. Oh. oh, sorry, I was sneezing. Holy shit, I muted and I sneezed a bunch. Oh. Okay. That is now functional. In all honesty, I could just do that along, along the entire thing. That would be a far... Far, far better solution than what I'm doing. Oh my god. Uh, I wasted all my iron. No, dude. Oh god. No, it's fine. I, I want to use these. Okay, I want. I want to. I want to use these, alright? It wasn't a waste. I want to use these. They are a cool thing that definitely has a reason to exist. I feel like, honestly, genuinely, in modern Minecraft, I don't think these would be added because they're not useful. Because truthfully, especially with redstone blocks being a thing, you don't need this at all for any reason. Redstone torches, redstone block, they work way better. They're more compact and convenient. And they're a lot cheaper. You know, I can, I honestly don't even know if I can think of any moment in time where this is even useful. I mean, I guess it's like a pressure plate in general, right? So, couldn't you open like a door with it? I don't know. You can't exactly have a door on a railway, can you? Maybe these would be useful if you could have like a trap door rail where like only the minecart can go through or something. That would actually be a cool way to go about things. 
Like, that'd be useful for adventure maps, I think. Imagine that, having Half-Life style uh, tram, Half-Life or like Resident Evil 4 style trams to get between areas in an adventure map. That would be cool. <clears throat> and then you have corners like this where, yeah, no, you're not putting a detector here unless it can curve, but you can't. See, that's a problem because now we need to push this back by one. Oh, God, no, more than that even. Wow. No! Okay, I was about to, I was just walking without any input, and that scared me. I was going to walk off the edge. It'll work. Yeah, it'll work. Yeah, it'll work. It'll be fine, guys. It'll be elegant and wonderful by the time we're done, okay? When are we going to get done? Well, not in this episode. I'm going to be honest. Let me, let me know if you guys have got this far, then... Let me know um, what you think. Should I just do the rest of this off camera and then focus on the building supports next time? Or should I... Because this, this actually might take like a while. <laughs> this might take a while. I mean, these bridges are long. These bridges are quite long. And I don't know. I mean, I mean, there's stuff I could just talk about, you know. I could just have have a chat as I do this and just talk about some things, but I don't know. There's not there's not been a whole lot on my mind lately, though. In in general, to be honest, again, I'm just kind of going with the flow right now and enjoying how things are going. I'm not really. Well, I guess I never really was, but I don't I don't know. Actually, I don't. What reason would I have to talk about interesting things? Well, because I want to have something interesting to talk about, obviously. <clears throat> That's a bit of a weird thing. That's fine, actually. I can fix that. Do that. We can just like kind of leave it open, I guess. I mean, yeah, that's one way to do it. Because it lets you out here as well. Okay, that's fine. The windmill. I like the interior of this. I haven't been in here in a while. What is there? A torch? Oh, there literally needs to be a torch, obviously. I feel like up is a better spot for them all. Yeah, I like that. I mean, it's excessive, but I don't mind. Yeah, I think that's fine. Okay, well, I'm going to end this episode of uh, Minecraft Beta here. Let me know what you guys think I should do when it comes to uh, building and expanding upon the bridge. I think it'll be fine when it's done, but I think it is going to be a repetitive process. Um, and if I am going to have, like, a building episode where I'm just doing monotonous stuff, uh, I'd rather... I'd rather save my conversation for when I'm building something kind of different, like the when I build the supports, because that'll be a little different. I mean, it's still going to be... You know, relaxing building, but you know, it'll it'll be a nice, it'll be a little bit of a, at least a change of pace. Hello, pig. Come inside. It's safe in here. It's safe in here. Trust me. I'm the good guy. Trust me. Come on. What are you doing? Come in the come in the house. Come in the house. No, I said to come in the house. Come over here. You coward. You're nothing but a coward. You know that. Maybe you'd all live if you had some spine. Maybe then I would have spared you. You know, I would have given you some respect. But no. You let yourself be prey. And so prey you shall be. And prey upon you shall I do. Where do I put meat? Probably in the kitchen. But we're putting it in here for now. Because I don't have room. Come here, pig. I already got your friends. Are you gonna also choose to be prey like the rest of them? Or shall you have a heart? Shall you have a spine? No, you're just trying to break it. You're just trying to break in. Take my stuff. I saw the look in your eyes. That was a very sane and not deranged thing to do at all. Okay, well that's... Oh, you know I could have done my achievement with the saddle. Oops. Well, that's going to do it for this episode of Minecraft Beta, <laughs> as I was saying. Thank you guys so much for watching. 
if you did. I really appreciate it. Let me know what you think of what I did so far and whether or not I should do it off camera or if I should just bite the bullet and have these nice relaxing episodes where I just build on this. I honestly, I, I wouldn't be opposed to just doing a video that I just, I just do the whole thing. And even if it's five hours, I don't care. <laughs> you know what I mean? Then we'll see. I don't know how I would, I don't know how I feel about making a video like that though. I don't know. At that point, I'd rather stream it, but we'll see. I don't, I don't know. That's up to you guys. What do you want me to do? Anyway, that's going to do it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. You know, I always come back. And while I have been, while I have been snippy, you know, I'll see you around. I just didn't want to forget again, you know? That's all. Yeah, I don't need your criticism.